He guides me in the path of righteousness for his namesake. Palms 23.3. That's the only thing I can think of because this is the path that I take every day to work. And it is a back to work for me. After two weeks of being off, unfortunately, got to pay the bill somehow. Welcome everyone, it's my daily vlog channel, Eric B's Daily Vlogs. After 12 days in Japan, two weeks being off, it is back to work. Jeez, back to work for you guys who has not been off for the past two weeks or even been off for the weekend. You know the feeling that you get when it's time to go back to work. It's back to work. I got two more weeks till I take a day off, which is Veterans Day. Then a couple weeks after that, which is Thanksgiving weekend. So I'm not gonna complain. I'm not gonna complain at all. And I must say, Japan was a damn good experience. Really good experience. I mean, in a way, in a way, kind of humbled me. Made me realize what culture is outside of the United States, where for the past 40 plus years I spent my whole life in. And, you know, living, going there with a bunch of Hawaiians, a bunch of Americans when we were on the cruise ship, it's made me realize that, you know, you gotta value life a little bit more the way the, way the Japanese does. They, they don't take life for granted. They embrace life and enjoy life for what it is and give it all they got. That's something we have to do here in the United States. But back to work, let me get some coffee. I need some coffee. So this, probably gonna be my last cup of coffee at Starbucks. And the only reason why is Lanai, when we were out in Japan, kind of showed us if I budget it right and focused on saving some money, I could save enough money to do another trip in Japan. So what I did was I bought a coffee maker and some Starbucks spiked coffee and that's what I'm going to be using to make my coffee every morning. But this is going to be the last mobile order for a while. So slowly getting back into the swing of things, a little difficult, especially after 12 days of being in a different time zone. But you know, work is kind of like riding a bike. Once you get back into the swing of things, you know, you, you slowly start to remember the things that you need to do and the stuff that get, needs to get done. But just found out last night that Japan was hit with a typhoon, a big scary typhoon, affected a lot of the areas that we visited, and then the cruise ship that we left did another tour around Japan, and they stopped in Busan, like we did, we stopped Busan, and they couldn't leave Busan because of how bad the typhoon was going, so they stayed in Busan till the next day, so I think this morning they left. So. You know, prayers and hopefully everyone's safe. Lanai went out there again for another trip. Hopefully, you know, he landed okay from the message that I got from him. So hopefully they're okay. So, luckily we left when we did. Luckily we did. This turned out to be a nice, beautiful autumn day here in San Francisco. Sun's being down. Blue skies everywhere. It's a nice, nice warm day today. Unexpectedly warm. And birds are attacking me. And they're all right there. Believe it or not, I survived a whole day, whole day at work today. Which is, which is a good thing. First day back, full day at work. Easy morning, a little rough afternoon. I had a clinic this afternoon, so. First day back, it's good to be back. Happy to be back, happy to be back in the flow of things. And in due time, my body, my mind will catch up to all the other stuff that we're doing also. So, good thing, good thing. So today was just about making sure I got back into the swing of things, making sure I got back into the workflow, and I did. So that is it. Thanks for watching, guys. Vlogs ended, go in peace.